Night. A family on Maui trying to pick up the pieces again tonight after their home is flooded for the second time in less than a year. Let's take a look. So sad. Look at these photos taken by the Maui newspaper. Hinano Nelson's home in Wailuku submerged in knee high water after yesterday's rainstorm. And even sadder, his kids' Christmas gifts all destroyed. Mm. Alexander Zane spoke with Nelson, who says despite all the hardship, there's much to still be thankful for this holiday season, Alex. Yeah, that's right, guys. Nelson's son turned three two days ago. Instead of celebrating his son's birthday, he's been trying to save his home, which was recently renovated. But he tells me he's been overwhelmed by the community's support. These pictures sent to us by the Maui News show what Hinano Nelson and his family have been going through since heavy rains hit Maui. Yeah, they said seven dump runs and it's so scary, you know. It, you know, it's, it's easy to see it in the picture, but when you come here and actually face, face something like this, it's a whole different ballgame, you know. Hinano did everything he could, but the flood water was able to make it into every room in his house, ruining nearly everything in his home, including the Christmas gifts for his three-year-old son and five-year-old daughter. Hinano's stepfather and pastor at the church connected to the home tells me this isn't the first time the home is flooded. So Hinano and his family, um, actually we just got done with, uh, we just got done a couple months ago with the renovation from last, from last year. And uh, moved them all in with a new, we put new tile, a new bathroom, and all kinds of stuff. We did a, a renovation, and, and now it, <coughs> it was flooded. What was supposed to be a time for celebration turned into a fight to salvage any of the family's belongings. I'm celebrating my son's third birthday. And instead of celebrating his birthday, I was down here fighting the flood. That should have not happened. Hinano tells me he's grateful for the support the community has already shown, helping to clean and scrape mud off the walls. As for his children, he says this is the second year in a row they lost their Christmas presents. My son, he's a superhero. My daughter, she loves Moana and Frozen. You know, that's, that's the kind of gifts and, and love. They love hugs. Pastor Greg says this week's flooding is the worst he's ever seen. He tells me the church's 7,000 square foot basement was also flooded, along with dorms where there are where the church hosts a transitional program for men recent re recently released from jail. Justin, I'll send over to you.